For the first method, we're going to right click on the Windows Start icon in the bottom left, then we're going to head over to Settings. Once we're on it, we're going to head over to Display, and then you want to expand multiple displays, and then make sure that the first two are ticked. You can tick all three of them if you want. But once they're all ticked, click on Detect Other Display. If it says we didn't find another display, it means that your monitor is not physically connected to your computer. It may be something wrong with the cable or it's just not physically connected. But if you get another message, then we're going to move on to the next step. For the second method, right click on the Windows Start icon, then head over to Device Manager. Once you're on it, we're going to expand Display Adapters. Then we're going to right click on our graphics card. It doesn't matter if it's Nvidia, Intel or AMD, just right click on it, head over to Update Driver and then click on Search Automatically. If the best driver has been installed, we're going to go back, we're going to click on Browse My Computer for Drivers and then click on let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer and then you might have multiple options right here you want to try all of them so just click on it then click on next try that for all of the options that you have over here if that still is not fixed the issue we're going to right click on your graphics card head over to properties and then head over to driver then we're going to take a note of the date right here and the driver version once you know that just head over to your manufacturer's website for example intel nvidia or amd and then install the latest drivers if you don't know how to do that instead skip to these timestamps which will show you for your specific graphics card manufacturer how to get the latest drivers starting with nvidia head over to the link in the description and then download geforce experience and install it once you download it and you sign in head over to drivers and then click on check for updates and then you might have an update for your driver so if it says it then just download the update for amd head over to the link in the description and then download this and it will automatically check if you have any updates for your driver, which you can do. Or you could just use your graphics card right here, follow all the steps, click on submit, and then it'll give you a download link for your latest driver. For Intel, head over to the link in the description and then download this and it will automatically check if you have any updates. If you do, it will update it for you. 